Hey, what's up, fam? Senor Cigar here. You are wherever you are. Hopefully, you are healthy and staying safe and all of that. So, um, uh, it is Monday. It is a brand new week, another chance to do great things. And I want to wish everybody a productive and profitable week. So, here I am in lower Manhattan, Soho, Father Fagan Park, a little meet time before the workflow. And, uh, it is time for the New York's GNS Virtual Hearth. New York's grown and sexy in the city cigar group. We've been there. We have done that, enjoying and promoting the cigar lifestyle since 2009. We're not new to this. We are so very true to this. So family, here we are. Beginning of a new week. And for uh, many of you with kids, I do believe this is the last week of school before summer vacation. And I know the kids are ready to go nuts. And I know you're ready to go nuts because what is we gonna do with these kids? Well, you will figure it out. Well, that's for me. Putting in a little me time before the workflow. I'm sitting here in Father Fagan Park putting some smoke in the air with this Padron 7000 Maduro. One of my all time faves. And you know, when I'm chilling, putting some smoke in the air, you know Senor's got to do that diet. Mountain do his to ya. Ah, yeah. That's always good. All right. So, fam, as I was saying, a little me time before the workflow, I'm working the night shift, the evening shift, all this week. Working until midnight, so that's what I'm doing, you know? But uh, for many of you, you might be near the end of your work day or it's already over. But wherever you are in your day, the hope that you're having a good day and that the rest of your day goes absolutely fantastic. So, as we always do, shout out to the medical professionals, the first responders, EMS workers, police and fire postal workers, MTA workers, delivery people, truck drivers going across the country, the mom and pop shop owners, the bodega shop owners, the laundromat owners, anybody who has been considered or deemed essential personnel during the pandemic and going forward, thank you for taking chances with your own health and safety, for the health and safety of all of us in this city, in this state, and around this country. What you have been doing, it is so greatly appreciated. Saying thank you is not enough, but we do start out by saying thank you for everything you have been doing during the pandemic and beyond. And of course, I'm going to remind everybody to please check in on the elders of your family, your family and friends who live alone. They need to hear from you. They need to know that they are not alone and they need to know that someone loves them. So please get in touch with them any way you can, whether it's through a phone call, a text message, Social media, video chat, Zoom, house party, Google Duel, FaceTime, Skype. And remind the people within your circle of friends to do that very same thing. Get in touch with their elders and their family and friends who live alone. Fam, no one needs to be alone at this particular time in our lives. Absolutely no one. So please take the time, make the time. Reach out to them. Find out how they're doing. See if they need anything. See if there's anything you can do for them. If this is someone you profess to love, then this should not be a problem. Because family, it is all about support. We are just one big family. And we got to take care of each other. All right? It is what we call support. And while we are talking about support, let us not forget all those fine ladies and gentlemen, those great people that own the mom and pop shops, those great small businesses, those great cigar shops and lounges in the tri-state area. They need our support now more than ever as well. Whether it's a shop where you can come in, make that purchase, grab and go, or maybe it's a lounge with comfortable seating where you can come in, make your purchase, Find a spot to plop, sit back, relax, light up, put some smoke in the air like so. Look at this. Watch me now. Yeah. Maybe uh, 
pair your fine tobacco product with your drink of choice, whether it be an adult beverage or a soft drink. Once again, that is your choice. And maybe even have a conversation with another brother and sister of the leaf. But please understand, none of that can be done unless you make the effort to go to that mom and pop shop. So, what does that mean? It means exactly this. You're going to break open the piggy bank, fellas. Open up that wallet. Blow the dust out. Pull out some dollar dollar bills, y'all. And make your way to that mom and pop shop. Whether you're driving or you're going to let somebody else do the driving for you. Uber or Lyft or get on the bus or the subway. Or your e-bike or your bicycle or your moped or your, 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 your motorcycle. Or your skateboard or your pogo stick. I don't know. Maybe roller skates. I said roller skates. And make your way to that mom and pop shop. And once you get there, come on. Now you walk right in. Say hello to the fine tobacconist behind the counter. Because they will help you make your decision. Then you step right on into that humidor and take a look around. See what's on the shelves. Make your selections proudly go up to that cash register and make it rain baby make it rain spend a few dollars to keep their cash register ringing and their doors open because it is all about support hashtag support mom and pop shops hashtag support small business hashtag support black business hashtag support latino business hashtag support asian business hashtag support small business it is the right thing to do family we are all in this together and we need each other now more than ever. So please, take the time, make the time. Go out to that mom and pop shop, that great cigar shop or lounge in the tri-state area and show your support. All right? All right. Now, you know what I'm doing tonight. I'm working. I'm in the studio, pressing those buttons, riding those levels and doing what I do. What about you? What happens when the uh, whistle blows and, and the clock strikes five, six, seven, whatever time you get off? What you gonna do? Maybe you got a nice romantic dinner plan with your significant other. Ah, yeah, that sounds pretty good, huh? Or maybe you decided you're gonna go hang out at a bar and, you know, throw some back, pound some down with some friends. Or maybe you said, you know what, I am going to go to that mom and pop shop, that great cigar lounge. You put some smoke in here with some brothers and sisters of the leaf. Or maybe you got tickets to see a movie or a Broadway show or a concert or a comedy show. Or maybe you, you, you want to go sing karaoke. I don't know. But whatever you got planned, make sure that a part of that plan is staying safe. Stay safe so you stay healthy so you can stay alive. The coronavirus, yes, they say the pandemic is over. But we know the coronavirus is here. It ain't going away. So you have to do all you can to make sure you do not contract COVID-19. And part of that plan of staying safe and staying healthy is staying hydrated. Whenever you go out, have that bottle of water, that iced tea or that lemonade or whatever you need to stay refreshed and hydrated. I am telling you, fam, take it from Senor Cigar. You will thank me later that you took that advice. I am so sure of it. All right? So whenever you go out, just make sure that you stay safe. All right? So, fam, I am going to wrap this up for today. It's a, not a great day out here, but right now the sun is kind of out, partly sunny, partly cloudy. But they are talking about rain a little bit later, so if you're going out tonight, just take care of yourself. Have your umbrella and just chill. You know, just, just be good. Just be good. Now, I am going to wrap this up for today so I can uh, get on with my business of pressing those buttons, riding those levels and doing what I do. But family, please do not forget. Check in on the elders of your family, your family and friends who live alone. They need to hear from you. They need to know that they're not alone. They need to know that someone loves them. They need to know that together 
we will get through this and we are getting through it and we're going to get through it all right hashtag support mom and pop shops hashtag support small business and if you're going out tonight tomorrow night any night this week this weekend hey just have a plan to stay safe so you stay healthy so you can stay alive that is it that is all i got i am that man senior cigar enjoying my fine tobacco product popping my collar because i can and as always i want to wish you long ashes And better days. Everybody, enjoy the rest of your Monday. At some point, I do hope you'll be able to put some smoke in the air. You know, love you like a fat kid loves cake and hope to, and hope to talk to you again real, real soon. Maybe tomorrow. But in the meantime, holla if you hear me. Yeah, baby.